Hey, director James Comey and a Grass Valley Charter School have in common a canceled fundraiser. This is after one of his tweets was picked apart by conspiracy theorists and the event connected to a possible terror attack has been deemed not credible. CBS Steve Large is in Grass Valley with his bizarre story. Insane. Nobody should have to live in this kind of environment. This is ridiculous. Wendy Willoughby and Kathy Foster are co producers of the Grass Valley Charter School Foundation's Blue Marble Jubilee. We were looking at probably attracting about 1,500 people this year in our small community. The festive Grass Valley event is now canceled following a strange sequence. Very strange. It's ridiculous, and so you sort of want to laugh it off as something that. Doesn't have a lot of merit. Former FBI director James Comey posted this tweet hashtagging five jobs I've had. A deep state conspiracy theorist took that tweet, dissected it, and came up with an acronym from Comey's five jobs that are the same as the initials in the Grass Valley Charter School Foundation. Then found letters in Comey's tweet that spelled jihad and posted it to social media. The alarming message spread among conspiracy theorists. Disbelief? in many facets. Number one, that this could be happening to us in this tiny little town. Will it be in Foster say out of concern someone could take the message seriously? They felt forced to cancel the fundraiser. These theories, although based in no reality or fact or evidence, can often drive unstable people to do really dangerous things. A small town fundraiser halted. How could this be happening? Hijacked by a wild conspiracy theorist. Spread on social media, threatening school safety. Yeah, one more live, live look at this uh, poster of the Blue Marble Jubilee, which again will not be happening now. And the, the event organizers say it's all because of what they describe as the dark side of social media. They had been hoping to raise between twenty and twenty-five thousand dollars. Fifteen hundred people were planning to come to the event. The whole thing's been scrapped. Yeah, with the climate of this country, though, a lot of people scared, and so they were taking precautions. Steve, thank you. What a bizarre story.